On September 13, 2024, the Indian Defense Research and Development Organization DRDO, announced a significant milestone in the development of India's defense capabilities, the successful completion of the first phase of field firing trials for the Zorawar light tank. Conducted in the demanding desert terrain, the trials met all objectives, proving the tank's combat effectiveness and accuracy. This marks an essential step in India's ongoing modernization of its armored warfare fleet, specifically tailored for high-altitude operations and difficult terrains. The Zorawar project emerged from the necessity for a lightweight yet powerful tank that could maneuver efficiently in mountainous regions, where traditional battle tanks struggle. The project's conception dates back to 2022 when it was confirmed that Indian company Larson and Tubro, LNT, was chosen as the primary development partner. The tank's concept was publicly unveiled during DEF Expo 2022, with the first prototype slated for delivery by 2023. By April 2023, reports indicated that the Indian Army could induct up to 700 Zorawar units, drastically enhancing its ability to maintain a strong presence in high-altitude areas, especially those along the volatile line of actual control, LAC, with China. The initial plan called for procuring 354 units of the tank, with a timeline set for full combat readiness by 2027. The Zorawar tank's development reflects India's broader push for self-reliance in defense manufacturing and military modernization. Numerous indigenous industries including micro, small and medium enterprises, MSMEs, have contributed to the project, demonstrating India's growing expertise in domestic defense production. The tank, named after 19th century military leader General Zorawar Singh, is designed specifically for the unique challenges of mountainous warfare, symbolizing its intended use in the rugged landscapes of Ladakh and Tibet. Weighing approximately 25 tons, the Zorawar is built to be agile and deployable in high-altitude regions, where traditional tanks like the T-72 and T-90 struggle due to their weight and mobility limitations. The tank is equipped with a powerful Cockerill 3105 turret, armed with a 105mm gun capable of engaging both armored targets and fortified positions. Furthermore, the Zorawar is designed for amphibious operations and can serve as a limited artillery platform, offering versatile tactical options in the field. One of the defining features of the Zorawar tank is its adaptability to challenging operational landscapes. The extreme altitudes of regions like Ladakh have posed significant challenges to the Indian Army's existing tank fleet during conflicts with China. The skirmishes between 2020 and 2022 along the LAC underscored the limitations of heavier tanks in these terrains, accelerating India's focus on developing a light tank capable of operating in such conditions. The Zorawar's lightweight design allows for rapid air transport to remote areas, enhancing India's ability to respond quickly to threats along its border with China. The tank's strategic value is heightened by China's own deployment of light tanks in the region, making it critical for India to maintain parity in mountain warfare capabilities. India's Zorawar light tank project represents a significant leap forward in addressing the unique operational challenges posed by high-altitude warfare. With its agile design, powerful armament and indigenous manufacturing base, the Zorawar tank is set to play a crucial role in maintaining India's defensive posture along the LAC and other contested regions. As the project progresses toward full-scale production, the Zorawar will become a key component of India's efforts to modernize its military and enhance its armored capabilities in some of the world's most challenging terrains.